Hi, my name is Steve Houston. Welcome to my channel. On this channel, we talk about all things IMOs, comp plans, mortgage section, final expense, IULs, annuities, advanced products. We talk about all the different IMOs. We talk about the comp plans. We compare them. We provide third-party documentation and the facts that go along with it, and we allow you to decide. Welcome to my channel. This is our video for Sundays on Random Thoughts, and this week I'm going to be talking about the seven secrets of sales success. Look, the number one on the seven series is just get serious. Make a decision to go all the way to the top of this field. Uh, there's so much opportunity, so many reasons to do it. You have three ways of, of income here. You have personal production, you have residual income, and if you choose to build your own agency, you also can build a passive or a leveraged base income. Look, we're all in it for the same reasons, and that is we get paid very, very, very well. Uh, it's a, the only trillion dollar industry on the planet, uh, highly, highly regulated industry. Get yourself a license, uh, get contracted with an IMO, uh, and I have my opinions about the IMOs. Uh, steer away from the network marketing type IMOs unless you're into that network marketing type concept where all your support and training comes from that particular person that may or may not have ever sold a policy in their life. They're just simply recruiters. And, you know, find your best fit. Uh, we can certainly talk. My contact information is in the description below. Text me, email me, call me. We can have that discussion. But this video is about the seven secrets of sales success. Make a decision. That's really largely what it's about to do your best uh, in this field and join the top 10%. Look, there is no one and nothing that can hold you back from being the best uh, in the field and in achieving your career goals except yourself. Take personal responsibility. I have a sign over my desk. I talk about it all the time. The surest way to succeed is to be determined not to fail. You've got to check your I quit factor. Find out what it's going to take for you to give up on your dreams and your goals. Because here's the deal. The, the industry has already been validated. There are multiple hundreds, if not thousands, of people making multiple six figures in this industry. No recruiting, simply going out there, taking care of customers, protecting families, working the lead program, uh, and coming home. Incredible work-life balance. Uh, if they can do it, you can do it. You just have to figure out what your I quit factor is. Uh, this whole concept of this generation where, uh, you know, if you hit your head against the door too many times, well, it must not be for me is rubbish. All success comes through failure. If you're committed to succeed, you will be willing to fail and fail over and over again until you figure it out because that's the only difference between you and the top income earners who are making multiple six figures working on a part-time, full-time basis, period. It's your determination, your desire, and your dreams and goals, and whether or not you're willing to wake up every day and fight for them. You've got to know what you're fighting for. Number two, identify your weakest skill and make a plan to become absolutely excellent in that area. Ask yourself and your coach or mentor, what one skill, if I developed that and did it consistently in excellent fashion, would have the greatest positive impact on my sales? Whatever the answer to that question is, write it down and set a deadline, make a plan, and then work at it every single day. That decision alone can change your life. Number three, and this is a big one, get around the right people, right? Get around successful people and associate with men and women that are going places with their lives, right? Get rid of the people that are negative, that are going to pull you down, they're going to be anchors to your boat. This is key. You've got to control the six inches of space between your ears. And that has a large part in being around the right kind of people and being willing to push aside people that are pulling you down, telling you what you cannot do what you're not able to do, and you've got to stop listening to those people. You've got to stop listening to yourself and start talking to yourself. Invest in personal development, get into book reading, and control the six inches between your ears. And sometimes those people that are pulling you down will be the closest people you have in your life. It could be your parents, could be your spouse, could be your best friend, and you may have to take a time out on those people for a while because if success is important to you and building a lifestyle, work-life balance, 
is your dream, you've got to take action. You've got to be selfish. You've got to protect the six inches between your ears. And it starts with being around the right kind of people. These people that drag you down, tire you out, distract and discourage you, you've got to get rid of those people. You've got to have a time out. Okay? That could be the number one even though it's number three, it could be the number one thing of the seven secrets to sales success. Number four, take excellent care of your physical health. This is very, very important. That's why I go to the gym. I don't do it enough. I, I'm on the treadmill. I'm on the stair machine, whatever it takes. You've got to take care of your physical health. In order to be at the top of your game, you need high levels of energy to sell effectively, okay? To be at your best, right? And to bounce back from continual rejection and discouragement, you've got to be in great physical health. Be sure to eat the right foods, get the right amount of exercise, and plenty of rest and relaxation. Okay, very, very good point. Number five, visualize yourself as one of the top people in your company, in your industry, or your field. Create pictures in your mind of you being at the awards banquet, going across the stage, and getting that recognition. Put yourself in that position, visualize it, and hold on to it. Imagine yourself performing at your best all day long. Imagine achieving your career goal. Feed your subconscious mind with vivid, exciting, emotional pictures of yourself as positive, competent, and completely in control of every part of your life. These clear mental pictures pre-program yourself and motivate you to sell at your best in any situation. Number six. This goes back to talking to yourself and not listening to yourself. Practice a positive attitude and positive self-talk continually throughout the day, throughout the week, throughout the year. Control your inner dialogue. Talk to yourself the way you want to be talked to. Key point there is to stop allowing your brain to tell you who you are. Tell your brain who you are and who you are becoming. Very, very important. Number seven, take positive action towards your career goals every single day. Be proactive rather than react. This is simple. Grab the bull by the horns. If you're not happy with your income, go out there and sit face to face with more customers every single day, every single week. Increase the activities, the results will come. Look, this is important. This is, a, this is the last part of number seven, and it's the most important part. If you're not happy with any area of your life, take personal responsibility, go out there, take charge, and change it. There's an old saying that I love. I keep it around. I talk, my agents have heard this a thousand times. Until the pain of the same becomes greater than the pain of change, nothing in your life is ever going to change because you're not going to be able or be willing to take action. All right, so I hope that helped this week. The seven secrets of sales success. I know it was a short video, but a powerful subject. And I could talk about it for hours. Hope you get some value out of it. Hope you get value out of this channel. Do me a favor. Hit that subscribe button below, mash the button. You'll get instant notifications of new videos. Do me a favor, push the like button and make some comments. I love to, make, to get the comments and I respond to all the comments. And again, if you are pushing the, the, uh, the like button, hitting subscribe, sharing the video out, more people like you that are getting value out of this channel will be able to come and find it and uh, get value of themselves as well. So appreciate you being here. My contact information is below. As always, I'm here to talk. Text me, email me, call me. My contact information is in the description of the video. You can uh, reach out to me at any time. Love just to hear from you. If you're looking to change IMOs or you're looking to consider an IMO or if you're just stuck where you're at, this channel is for you. I hope to add value to your life. Bye-bye. Have a great day.